Good day, ladies and gentlemen. My name is George Kakavos, and I am the product manager as well as a support engineer for CyberPower Systems, a global leading manufacturer of UPS systems, inverters, relevant accessories, and pretty much everything else that relates to power management solutions. Today, I would like to take a few minutes first to talk to you as to why you would probably need to have a UPS system among the equipment you deem necessary for your office or home. UPS system can protect against several power deterrents. I prepared a few slides to show the most common needs for uh, UPS, actually the most common causes as to why a UPS is needed, starting with a spike or a surge, which is a very short event, usually lasts a few milliseconds, and it can throw your equipment out of whack. It can also cause damages to certain electronics inside sensitive equipment. A UPS, which always includes a surge protection inside, measured in joules, will absorb this type of a spike or surge, thus preventing your equipment from being damaged. A second phenomenon is called RFI, which is simply radio frequency interference from nearby devices. If uh, you have uh, line noise uh, usually into your power grid, uh, if you live close to an industrial area, if you have a lot of items inside your home, such as uh, high-speed motors, uh, or microwaves which are operating in close proximity or any type of equipment that can cause an RFI disturbance will create line noise that can be harmful to certain uh, electronics, uh, electronic devices you might be using. The RFI is a condition that can be filtered uh, using a UPS system. So for example, if you have your TV that has snow effect uh, when you have a microwave oven, uh, running next to your TV, a UPS RFI filtering will help eliminate that snow noise. Another condition is overvoltage, and that's a very, very severe condition that can be detrimental to your electrical equipment. Overvoltage is a voltage spike, which can be from 10 volt, 15 volt, up to maybe even 50, 60, sometimes 100 volts over the limit, operating limit of your equipment. Such a condition will definitely destroy a big part of your household or office equipment, uh, even those systems which are designed to withstand overvoltage conditions. Uh, like I said, some of the voltages can be just too severe. A UPS can help you prevent such a catastrophe by switching to battery mode or by using special technology to regulate power level to the optimum input of your equipment. Uh, another condition that a UPS is very important to be used is a brownout. A brownout, uh, it's a condition where the electrical grid, when it's overloaded, suddenly drop the intensity of the voltage into a very low level, usually below 200 volt, uh, very common number is about 180 volts. This will cause certain equipment to either shut down or even uh, develop uh, damaging effects after such a brownout. A UPS can help you uh, uh, overcome uh, this problem and act as a deterrent uh, using technology that will either boost the power into a nominal level or it will switch to battery mode in order to overcome the brownout condition. Lightning is a very severe condition and very common. Uh, if lightning is too close to your home, maybe nothing will be good enough to save uh, your equipment, but in most of the cases, lightning produces huge amounts of surge for a very brief period of time that can damage any type of electrical or electronic equipment. Uh, UPS that uh, contains surge protection material inside will safeguard against most cases that can be detrimental to your equipment. Power cut is a condition for which you definitely need to have a UPS. If there is no power, nothing works. A UPS will switch automatically to backup power using the built-in battery and an inverter technology that will help you to uh, continue normal power flow into your equipment. Uh, depending on how long is the power outage, can be a few minutes or a few hours even, uh, UPS system can be chosen so that uh, you can cope with this type of uh, deterrent. Power back surges. Uh, this is something very important. A power back surge can be uh, detrimental to your equipment. When the power is restored, it can generate a severe magnitude spike that will definitely damage your equipment. Again, a UPS 
will help filter this type of spike and uh, regulate normal power flow into your equipment by using the inversion battery mode or by backing the power down to the nominal level. Last is telecom surges. Uh, sometimes inside the telecom lines uh, can be RFI noise and this type of noise can damage certain sensitive modem or ONT terminals. UPS that has filtering for telecom surges can help you eliminate any noise inside the ADSL or LAN cable that is connected to your telecom equipment, thus protecting it from any unwanted behavior. These are the most important factors to take under consideration and I thank you for watching this presentation. I will come back to you again uh, with methods to choose the proper UPS for you.